Hey guys, we're back with part two, and without further ado, let's begin. Motor Storm Pacific Rift, my favorite in the series, and one of my favorite games of all time. Yes, all time. This game is phenomenal. What can I say about it that won't make me sound like a fanboy? I really am when it comes to this game. But let us let's begin. I when I bought my PS3, I got Motorstorm, Pacific Rift, Dead Space, and Metal Gear Solid 4. From the three games I got with my system. All three of those games are fantastic. But this game I went back to more than the others. And that just goes to show, doesn't it? That if it can if I prefer it over Metal Gear Solid 4 and Dead Space, what does that tell you? And those two games are masterpieces in their own rights. But uh the game of memory I had with this game was it was a friend's 18th birthday, and he knew that I just got my, he had his PS3 since launch, and he knew I just got my PS3, and he said, oh, did you, you got Motorstorm, uh, do you want to bring it up when you come up to the birthday? And I said, yeah, okay, so I brought that in my controller, there was about 10 of us there, and Devil will vouch for this, all we did that night Besides, if we weren't drinking or having a good time, everyone was playing this game for player split screen because that's how good we like it was, and everyone loved it. Every everyone that night wanted to play this game. Like we had a few other games set up, like Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm and uh, Metal Gear. Ah, uh, Metal Gear. Sorry, Call of Duty: Modern Warfare. But no, everyone wanted to play this. And that's just one of the best, that's one of the memories, should I say, actually. I still remember playing online. Me and Devil would play this online when he got his version and his PS3. We had some really funny moments online. Some real, real jaw-dropping moments. Because when you're playing with others, so I mean, look at the AI. They've only been able to catch up because I've been I, I'm not very good at this game. I love it, but I'm not very good. But when you're playing against other people, it's like an entirely different game. And I know that sounds cheesy, but it is. It really is. And it improved on the first one, which was... The first one was already a good game in its own. I mean, they brought the... Uh, that you can play normal races and elimination and all by yourself. You don't actually have to play story mode which was a good bonus. The uh, multiplayer was the best in the series. Unfortunately, the servers are shut. Um, I mean, you can see the graphics. They're gorgeous. <laughs> um, the music's phenomenal. For some reason, I must have accidentally not changed my save data because it keeps looping, Slipknot. But, uh... Yeah, it's got Slipknot, Pendulum, David Bowie, Nirvana, you name it. You look at other recent games nowadays, like the new recent Need for Speed. What the fuck? There is no music in it. It's just all Wub Wub Step and all that shit. So, yeah. I mean, I love this game. And Evolution Studios, thank you for giving me one of the best gaming experiences I've had on the PS3 and arguably the best racing game that I've played outside of a Nintendo racing game. So, yeah, I mean, it's nothing really more to say, it's just watch the rest of the clip. And hopefully I don't fucking crash and lose the race, because that can happen in this game. You could be winning and you accidentally crash, and I probably just jinx myself. You can crash and they'll just shoot past you, but yeah, there you go. Uh, I'll see you in part three, guys.